and balancing small decorative carvings on their heads. <clears throat> in other news, hundreds of mysterious crop circles have appeared in cornfields across Illinois, and our roving reporter Ray is there right now. Yes, Kat, I'm standing in the center of one of these so-called crop circles as we speak. Amazing, Ray. I don't know if I've mentioned this before, but I'm a great believer in the existence of extraterrestrials. I've heard that they abduct people and replace their brains with sawdust, rendering them completely stupid and devoid of any personality. <laughs> Have you ever been abducted by aliens, Ray? Um, no, Cat. Wh what makes you think that? Oh, nothing. <laughs> Ray, this is all very mysterious. Are you completely sure this isn't the work of extraterrestrials? Absolutely, Cat. Everyone knows that crop circles are made by pranksters, probably art students, to make us think that the aliens are coming. You know, making a crop circle isn't as difficult as you think. All you need is a ball of string and a plank of wood. You simply tie the string to the center of the plank and anchor the other end of the string to the center of your crop circle. Then it's just a matter of flattening the crop as you shorten the string. Other methods include wearing really big shoes and using beard trimmers in conjunction with... <sighs> so definitely not the work of aliens, then. That's good to know. Thanks, Ray. And that's all from us here at Channel Z News.